Hi teachers, today I'm gonna to show you how you can quickly make adjustments and edits to your pacing guides, unit plans, and individual lessons, and why this is truly the most teacher-friendly planner out there. If you've ever created a unit plan or a curriculum map in a spreadsheet or traditional calendar, you know how tedious it can be to adjust dates or learning standards. You waste so much time deleting, rewriting, and copying text, and we wanna give you um, as much time back in your day as possible. So that's how we created um, a lesson and unit planner that can adapt with you and your students. So the first thing I wanna show you um, is how you can shift lessons, weeks, and unit plans from the calendar page. So as you can see, um, I already have a few weeks mapped out for unit two here. So the first thing we're gonna do is click the shift lessons button at the top of your screen. As you already know, you can create a super organized curriculum map or unit plan, but there are numerous things that can happen to disrupt that perfect plan. Maybe you had a sick day or there was a fire drill. Or maybe you've assessed your students and decided they need some more remediation time. Whatever the case is, you can make all these adjustments here. Let's say I just need to push back unit two a few days because I want to review unit one assessments with my students. So we're going to click um, units for the first question and then select the unit that we want to shift from the drop down. So unit two fractions. So this will shift all of the lessons with their standards and objectives that you have assigned to this unit folder. So from here, you're going to select if you want to move these lessons forward or backward on the calendar. So I'm going to push forward the start date of this unit five weekdays, then click confirm shift. So now you can see that this unit plan with all the standards, objectives, and lessons has been pushed forward a week. And I can go in and plan some review days for these class days. Super simple. And you can also do the same thing for individual and weekly lessons. So let's say that there was a fire drill um, this Tuesday, the 27th, that I forgot about, and I didn't really get to teach that day. So I need to push the standards and objectives for these three days. And instead of selecting units here, we're going to select specific lessons and then select the lessons we want to move in the drop down. And that's it. You know that these types of edits need to be made all the time, and it took us just a few seconds to do it with the Terra Lesson Planner.